Yo, what's up guys here, GTA Pupser here, and welcome back to another brand new GTA 5 video. In today's video, we're going to be talking about a huge minor issue that is happening if you're playing GTA Online on PlayStation 5. And I'm also going to be talking about in today's video some general information about GTA Online and where it's heading in the next couple days and more so let's get right into today's video so yes right I said there is a minor issue happening in GTA Online on the PlayStation uh, Sony consoles right now you know Sony makes the PS3 the PS4 and then recently the PS5 has come out and if you're wondering pup why are you not saying the PC or Xbox well Again, this problem but problem does not relate to you. So again, I don't play on the PlayStation at all. I am an Xbox guy at heart. I just, you know, I never got into pay playing on the Sony consoles uh, over my gaming career. But over, I guess, the past couple days, I don't think about a couple weeks, again, probably a couple days, it looks like Rockstar has you know, came up with an issue that you couldn't load into something. And there are actually, when you log on to GTA in general, like when you start the game up from your Sony console, you get this message that says this, Temporary issue inviting or playing with friends in GTA Online. Use PlayStation Join Friend Slash Party instead of in-game menus. We are aware of a temporary issue affecting some players when trying to invite or play GT Online with a party of friends using in-game menus. Please use PlayStation Join Friends slash Party System instead of an in-game menus as a workaround while we work to resolve the issue. For further support, please visit our support on Twitter at Rockstar Support or at support.rockstargames.com. So, well, this must be a like minor issue to Rockstar probably major to them because they had to put a loading screen on when you load the game now I don't know about you guys but when I load in GTA I'm usually on my phone you know I'm usually just checking up on my social medias you know or I'm busy talking to my friends and don't even pay attention to the loading screens but I guess you should start paying attention to the loading screens now because, again, looks like for the first time, you know, I never saw this, that Rockstar put a issue on the loading screen. And I don't know why they would post it on the loading screens because they got to know people like myself aren't going to be looking at them. And, again, when I checked Rockstar support on Twitter, I had, didn't see anything about this issue regarding the join friends party. So, you just I don't understand why Rockstar would put it on a loading screen and not their social medias if it was that such a big deal. So maybe again, probably Rockstar is trying to find a solution right now at this moment to try to fix this issue. Again, when I'm recording this video on uh, December the 29th, I haven't seen, you know, any updates on where it is fixed or not but again this issue looks like it's something where you know when you're trying to join a GTA Online game as you know you can usually join the game right from you know GTA screen you know when you get in story mode you just hit the start button or whatever or whatever button and then it comes up where you can go online and then you can join the game join friends solo public invite etc well that's the thing that is not working and that's what Rockstar is trying to resolve. So I want to make this video today just to warn you guys to, you know, prepare you if you're having any issues. Now, it looks like you can still get into a G2 online session, but you just have to, you know, um join it from the Sony or the PS screen. So that is pretty weird in general. I thought if there was an issue that you couldn't join like any game, etc. But again, last night when I was playing Xbox, when I usually do, I did get this weird message that I could not connect to the game at any means. And I was like, oh, wow, is this affecting the Xbox side? Uh, because I knew this PlayStation issue was happening. And so, again, I restarted the game, got the same message as you see on your screen. And then I, you know, just had to restart my console and then it worked fine. So, again, I'm not sure what happened. Now, regarding on to some, you know, general information of G2 Online stuff going on this, you know, couple days, 
as you see, if you log into G2 Online as we speak, the snowfall is still the game in the game. And you're probably shocked right now and saying, well, why is the snowfall still in the game? Because as you know, Rockstar likes to put the snowfall like two days before Christmas and then, you know, end it, you know, a day after Christmas or on end of Christmas night. And then, you know, we have regular GTA day until closer to the New Year's Eve and New Year's Day. And, you know, they, you know, expand it. Well, it looks like Rockstar noticed, well, 2020 has been quite a year. And that they want this snowfall to happen all week. As you know, we're on Tuesday right now, and it's almost New Year's Eve. So I wouldn't expect that Rockstar would end the snow like either tonight. Looks like they're probably going to extend it all this week. And my guess is maybe ending it Sunday, because that is like two year two days into the new year. So again, that is funny. And also, another note. There is an event week going on. Well, a double money, I should say, an RP. Now, probably no one has noticed this unless you actually look at the loading screens when you logged into GTA Online these past couple weeks. Well, if you go on the GTA events page, there this uh, double RP and money has started December 15th, I believe, and will be ending the 30th, and that was double money on in and out adversary mode so if you're getting tired of the ko preco heist at all means again is a good money maker and you want to try something different you still have a double money going on in the game so i just want to remind you of that but again that will be ending uh tomorrow is your last day to do that so i just want to remind you that we do have some double money and that looks like rockstar will be expend spending or expanding the snowfall in los santos for this whole week. So again guys. I want to hear from you in the comment section down below. If you do play PlayStation. Are you having this issue. And what happened. And again if you didn't like like today's video. Uh, remember to like it. And subscribe for more GTA videos like this. My name is Pup here. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.